오늘 우리가 둘이서 그냥 막 대화하는 것처럼 말하자 그치? 나도 폰 봤잖아 그러면 오늘 이 영상 만드는 이유는 아무 판단 없이 그냥 도와주고 싶어서 하는 거지 이 이슈에 대해서 얘기 좀 하자 But why talk about this topic? Because not many people are talking about it, yet it affects so many people. And I know the effect that porn can have on your life. 일단 괜찮아. 괜찮다고 말하고 싶어. This issue probably affects more people than you think. 70% of men aged between 18 and 24 visit pornography websites monthly, at least. And on average, one in three viewers are women. And now the average age in which a child first sees pornography is 11 years old. And 25% of all search engine searches are pornography related so this issue affects men women children it affects absolutely everyone let's talk about some of the proven effects of watching pornography one there's a strong link between clinical depression and watching pornography studies have shown that higher pornography usage is associated with lower self-worth and depressive symptoms two it has a big effect on marriages and relationships statistically speaking people that watch pornography are twice as likely to get divorced and according to one study 50 percent of all divorce cases involve one person being addicted to pornography. And three, pornography manipulates the viewers into thinking that women enjoy sexual violence and degradation. In a particular study, they surveyed the top 50 pornographic videos online and they found that out of all the scenes, 88% of scenes contain violence and 87% of the women's responses to that violence was either neutral or positive. Depression, divorce, violence against women. And this is just three of many, many negative effects. This is why this issue is so bad. It affects not only yourself, not only your relationships, but all of society. Now we know that almost everyone is affected somehow by this issue, men, women, and children. And now we know that watching pornography has negative effects on yourself, on your relationships and on society. What about God? As you know, this channel is, is about God, it's about Jesus, but how does he fit into this? Is God judging us? God angry? Is God mad? I think that God wants to help. Let me tell you a story. Adam and Eve, you know how it goes. God creates the world, God creates the humans, Adam and Eve, and they're in the garden and the snake tempts Adam and Eve into eating the fruit from the tree, which God said you cannot eat from. It was the one rule that God gave to Adam and Eve. When Eve sees the fruit, it says in the Bible that it looks pleasing to her eye so she takes a bite maybe to eve and maybe to adam it tasted sweet for a moment but then the consequences came as a result adam and eve have to leave the garden they have to leave god and god he promises to make a way to redeem this relationship the consequences far outweigh the, the moments of pleasure isn't it the same with pornography we see the video the title we see the cover we see the website we see the picture we click on it and it looks good and it feels good for a moment but then after that, there's consequences. There's the shame, there's the guilt, this feeling of emptiness, and not to mention the control and the addiction that follows. Ultimately, life is worse. So what can we learn from this story in Genesis? One, God wants to help, not to judge. We've fallen into this trap, but God wants to help and God wants to rescue us because of his love for us. God doesn't curse Adam, God doesn't curse Eve. He curses the snake. He curses the one that tempted, not the humans that fell for the temptation. Two, this life of being addicted is not God's original plan for you. God wanted you to be free. He created us and created you with purpose and meaning, not to be addicted to some website. That's not life at all. God wants to help and he has better plans for you. I can't solve the pornography addiction problem for you, but I can at least tell you that if there is a God, he doesn't want to judge and condemn you. He wants to help you and he can help you. Life is better when you're not addicted to pornography. Life is better and there is hope. There is a way. It is possible and I hope and I pray that this helps. It gives you a little bit more confidence, a little bit more hope that if there is a God, he wants you to have a good, awesome, free life because he loves you. 오늘의 영상은 좀 헤비했지. 만약에 질문이나 궁금한 거 있으면 댓글 남겨주시고 다음 영상도 꼭 기대하세요. 잘될 거야. 괜찮아질 거야. 동생, 파이팅. Bye bye.